Hey friend, you are back with the Aries Alchemist for another general tarot reading. And this is for my Leos. So if you're a Leo, sun, moon, or rising, something here's for you. Hmm. <laughs> so far you got the five of wands in reverse, the five of cups in reverse, ten of cups, and the two of cups in reverse. Definitely getting relationship energy here. But I'll clarify and then I'll get specific. Oh yeah, some shit's over for you fam. Five of, oh. I see you're not ready for it to be over though. Five of Wands, clarified by the tower. The way you stumbled upon this relationship in the first place was not good. So good things cannot come from it. I see you constantly trying to rebuild with this person, restart, give them a fresh slate to see if you guys can get it right the next time. Not necessarily in an on and off relationship type of way, but just like you mentally being like, okay, I'm gonna give them another chance. Let me try this first, stuff like that. But there's not enough tweaking you can do to save this relationship because it wasn't fucking supposed to happen. Five of Cups in Reverse, clarified by the King of Cups in Reverse. Your person is not even emotionally stable. They low-key shouldn't be with anybody right now. But you just have a complex to where you gravitate towards people with a lot of problems because you want to save them. That makes you feel worthwhile. So it's like a match made in hell instead of a match made in heaven type shit. Ten of Cups, clarified by the Eight of Wands in Reverse. You might have even noticed that this relationship moved really fast. Like y'all were saying, I love you within a month. Y'all were always at each other's house, possibly even living together within a couple months. And that's a red flag right there. Like you really need to slow down. You don't know people well enough to really love who they actually are versus their best foot forward that you see and you're convincing yourself is all there is. So part of this is just you not slowing down as well. Two of Cups in Reverse clarified by the Eight of Pentacles. Your person, though, they never even really had romantic feelings for you. They just saw you as beneficial. They saw that you were someone who likes to pick up broken pieces. And so they let all that shit break because they know you're going to pick it up. And that is just very convenient for them. A game of 52 pick up. Y'all used to play that? Where they literally would just throw all the cards on the ground and you just got to pick it up. It's not even a game. Like, that shit is so unfun. Like, that's basically how they feel about you. Sorry to break it to you. But part of you knows this. Because it's like you're doing all this work and the relationship isn't working. Why? Because they don't give a fuck, bro. But what is your word of the week? Ephemeral. And this is the day lily plant. So what's sticking out the most there is all that orange and yellow on the card. Telling you to get your sacral chakra and your solar plexus in order. That's going to help give you the confidence that you need to see that it's okay for you to not be the perfect match with this person because there is going to be somebody else out there that you really vibe with that would benefit you back. But you just need to cleanse and balance, get grounded, all that shit in order to see it. That's all, friend. But that's what I have for you guys. If anything resonated, like, comment, share, subscribe to the channel, all that jazz, and I will see you next week.